So I can just grab it. I mean, it's not like, oh my gosh. Oh, I got to open a drawer. Oh, it's like so hard. <laughs> no, it's not that hard. <laughs> she drools. She does it all. She even drools. Oh yeah. Here, cheers. Mm. He is like six foot seven or something. And the girl only stands up to about here. And she seems to be impressed with this boom box. Okay, uh, this is a very old box. I think the paper just came off. Let me see. I want coffee bad. <laughs> I really want coffee. Woo! I'm gonna make a cup of coffee. Well, today's video is a continuation from yesterday's video. It was about da 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 da. I felt trapped. I felt smothered. I felt like everything was closing in on me in my van, in my minivan. It happens every year. I know in your homes you go through it too. It's after Christmas. You brought in a lot of new things. You got a lot of presents. You bought yourself presents. And all of a sudden, you're, you're, you're just stuffed to the gills. Well, in a minivan, it's especially creepy. Yeah, I'm just going to keep making my coffee and talk to you for a minute. And then I'm going to continue on with organizing. That's what today's video is about. Da, 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 da. I'm Minivan Lee, and I live in my minivan full time, and I have for six years. Right now, I'm making coffee in my minivan. There's my stove making my water, my hot water. I've got my pour over type of coffee maker. I like to use a filter for it because it's so easy to just dump it when I'm done instead of having to wash it out. I'm in a minivan, I don't have a sink. And there's one of the issues where it has, I have to live a different, I have to have different lifestyle methods than just living in a house. Because normally, I remember, I lived in a house. I wasn't born in a van. <laughs> I live in a house. I've lived in a house for, you know, hmm, uh, let's see, for be 64 years, because I'm almost 70 years old. You can keep yourself in shape. You don't, 70 is not old. It's not old, oh my gosh. I lift weights and I walk and I, I go to the gym. I take care of my skin, I take care of my body. Um, I have a couple guilty pleasures, but uh, for the most part, I think I lead a pretty healthy life. But let's get back to this feeling trapped. Being caught in a trap. Caught in a trap. I can't walk out because I love you too much, baby. Remember that Elvis song, yeah? Well, I was caught in a trap and I did something about it. But but, but first, <laughs> go back to the video from yesterday if you haven't seen it. And that's where it started. I mean, I was going through, I was m maneuvering things. What I did was I um, opened up two, new, two drawers and some of this other stuff that's laying around here it's just laying around, which I, I don't like that. I, I want it to be easy peasy. I want to be able to not just have everything um, sitting out. <laughs> I want it to look really, I guess I do like that minimalist look. I do. I would like to have that minimal look. When I get a house, oh, I will get a house at some point again. But when I do, it's going to be minimal. I don't want junk all over the place. Oh, no. I want it to be minimal. I want to have open space. If I have a dresser or if I have a table, I don't want anything on it. I want it to just be there. Except maybe, you know, like that minimalist look, it's like one thing is there, a vase, a, a, a decent sized vase and it just sits there. Maybe that, but I do, I do not like clutter. And it, I can't think straight. And I think that's what I was getting really frustrated. It's like, I can't even think straight right now. And I just, I couldn't, I couldn't put my finger on what was making me so grumpy lately. And I realized that there's too much going on in my minivan. And I'm to even, sometimes to even get out of my minivan, 
I had to maneuver things. I called it the 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 nomad shift the shift dance. Shift things here, then shift them here, just to get under something. Well, I do put my bucket, my toilet bucket, when I'm when I'm in my living space, I just kind of park that in my captain's chair, right? But when I go to drive, I take it and I put it here. Big deal. But when I got to put three things down because I've got to, in order to be here, I've got to get rid of three things. Um, it's time to change the scenery. <laughs> it's time to make some changes. So after I make my coffee, I'm going to go ahead and kind of put some things and, and see what I can get in those drawers that do not need to be just floating around um, in my minivan. Okay. So now that I've set this up, you know what's going on, right? <laughs> right. That's what this video is about. It's in part two of um, getting Minivan Lee's um, mental uh, health back together <laughs> so she's not freaked out all the time. Yeah, poor Paul. I mean, he's like, you know... But, but although he's got his grumpy moments too, Paul is my travel partner. And um, he's like the opposite of me as far as like stuff. I He, he doesn't mind stuff laying all over. I... Um, I can't imagine there's, I will mention that there's nobody in my family um, that is a clutter bug. No, we all like things minimal. And I think, you know, I mean, it, my mom wasn't that great. She was an okay housekeeper, but she actually put the housekeeping onto, the, onto us. Like on Saturdays, we all had to vacuum the house and dust it and things like that. Yeah. But, um, I guess she kept a pretty clean house, but it wasn't like super clean the way I like it to be, the way I've lived my life. Okay, let me, I, my coffee, you didn't see it. I poured the water in here and I got coffee. It's still dripping a little bit. I'm going to put my butane away. I'll just describe what I'm doing because that would mean I'm, I don't, I know. It seems kind of. Sorry, <laughs> I just don't feel like putting the camera down all the time. Now I'm going to put, get in there. I'm going to put my stove away here. You can close see it. This is the kind of stove where I have to turn this over. Let's see. We'll get this done. You know, some people in their, in their vans, in their minivans even, they keep the stove out all the time. You know, but they've got, get in there, <laughs> punch it in there. Um, they've got a whole different system going on. A lot of people have a build out. I don't have a build out. This is my home. I sit on the floor. It's very cozy because I have padding going on under here. But they usually have like a bed frame going on here. And then over here, they've got like dressers, but they've got things on their dressers. Because they have a bed, they can just make their bed and they their blankets and pillows stay there. But because I roll out my bed at night and then roll it all back up in the morning, I park my pillows and blankets up here. So, and I'm trying to think of uh, like Glenna, she had the best setup of a minivan that I saw, oh my gosh. And she had a, a table here and her stove was always out. She also had a coffee maker. <laughs> hey, Glenna, shout out. She even had a coffee maker, so. Um, okay, let me go ahead. Where's my waste basket? Oops. Yeah, keeping it real, everybody. This is what I do. I'm even, I'm even including the huffing and the puffing moving <laughs> around here. So this is my coffee grounds left over. I just fold this up, whoops, and I dump it. Yeah. Coffee. Oh, this is going to taste so good. Well, the what you didn't see yesterday was I did take everything that I, I had to go dump and find a, um, a dumpster and dump my garbage. And then, because it was a big sack, then I went to my storage. And I just... I. I rearranged my storage. So you can see I'm a little bit dishuffled, <laughs> a 
a little bit. I know you go, you look fine, but I do feel a little disheveled. And um, I had to rearrange everything. Sh you know, do the shift game because it's not a big storage. It's like a little closet, really. And we're starting to fill it up. Oh yeah, you know how it is. If you got something, you always fill them in. Like if you have a house, this is my guilty pleasure. It's chocolate cream, it's, cream, it's um, coffee mate. And yeah, it just, so the coffee, the coffee gives me something that's got a boom box out there. I don't like those, do you? Uh, I don't like boom boxes. They're, they kind of, um, they, uh, they're kind of troubling to my spirit. It's that rumble, 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 oh yeah. Hey, I didn't know I could imitate that so good. Can you hear it? Maybe a little bit, but oh, that's okay. It's not the end of the world. There could be worse things, right? But it'd be nice if they, they could outlaw those. I think they did, they did have a law against those, but nobody enforces it, so. Mm. Sorry. Here's yours. <laughs> I love you. Here's mine. Cheers. Forget that I took a drink. <laughs> Forget that I took a drink out of yours. First, I think I'm dro drooling also. <laughs> it's that kind of a day. <laughs> drooling and all. I'm a real uh, YouTuber here, you know. <laughs> she drools. She does it all. She even drools. Oh, yeah. Here, cheers. Mmm. Yummo. <laughs> I was looking. There's a guy out there talking to a girl. I think this guy out here is like six foot seven. It's like six foot seven or something, and the girl somebody stands up to about here, and she seems to be impressed with this boombox. So I'm thinking, girls, if you would stop being impressed with it, maybe they would stop doing it. <laughs> Come on, girls, it's up to you. Yeah, they think they think the girls like it. Well, this girl don't like it, right? Okay, now I'm going to wipe off my... I'm gonna wipe off my tray and I'm gonna get going on this so you can see what I've got. Okay. Let me turn this on. Woo. Let there be light. We get light here. Let there be light. Okay. Okay, here's the deal. I've got this drawer. It's empty. It's actually clean because it wasn't that long ago I wiped all my drawers out. Okay, so I've got this. I'm thinking that I was thinking about putting things... Well, first of all, I think... I need to shift around. This needs to go here. There we go. And it's purple, purple. What I did with my drawers is I <laughs> I made these. It's like a hard, maybe like poster board. I get a Dollar Tree. And then I got some wrapping paper and I um, covered it. And then what I do is I slip it in so that... Who wants to have see-through? Not mean. Ain't nobody got time for that. And I'm going to put this one here. Because I'm thinking that I've got this here. I really don't want to look at this every day, day after day, day after day. I really don't want to look at it. I'm wondering if I can also get, I'm thinking of putting this box in there too. I'm wondering if I can do that. Okay. 
this is a very old box. I think the paper just came off. Let me see. Look at that, folks. This will fit right in here. Because why do I want to look at it up there? If it's so important that I just have to go like this and grab it. It can't be that important. I can actually pull out the drawer first and then reach in and grab it. It's only one step um, more added on, right? So I'm thinking, what do you think? If I could just put this in here, I think what I'll do is turn it around. So everything, I got my pens right here. I can still access my pens. I can do everything, really. Let me see, maybe turn it this way and this way. I can put a flashlight in here. This is my, I just think these are so cool. Um, if you, there, it, this is wax, it's scented wax. The, the, the lemon is so strong. I mean, it's almost overwhelming, but it's kind of cool. I hope it's not toxic, but um, this is the melting wax that you melt it with a wax melter. And, um, and then it, of course, goes into the air. But I found that, and I love the pretty box. I mean, I got this at Walmart. It, I just, I don't know. It looks like it's got, it's like quality, a, got a look, quality look about it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, um, I don't know the bee. You know that's pretty cool. But when you open it, it just goes in into the air. So I like this, but I don't want this to set out all the time. Does it fit in here? Well, if I put it sideways, it does. So I can just grab it. I mean, it's not like oh my gosh, oh I gotta open a drawer. Oh, it's like so hard. <laughs> No, it's not that hard. Okay, so I got that. And then I got my flashlight in here. Well, let's try it. Oh, my glasses. A little bit too. I put them there. Huh. This wants to get in the way. Okay. Okay. Well, what do I got here now? I got these... I got to take these off. These are those old um, glue pads. Look at that. Now, I got to move this back. No problemo. As uh, the Terminator would say, right? No problemo. Okay, let's see how this is going to go. Okay. Minnie, you got to go. Raven, you got to go just for a minute. This is for my fairy lights, by the way. It's to plug it. There we go. Oh, yeah, there we go. Now, first, what I'm going to do is I'm going to wash it. Let's do that. You get to see this in real time, folks. This is real life stuff, right? <laughs> okay. Let's see if this will just go right back in there. Let's see, it's got to go. Oh, it's. Um, let me wash this. Now it's got to dry, folks. That's the way it is. Okay. We'll let that dry. Wash this. Look at this. It's going to make it more minimal. Oh, my gosh. And I have this. This I bought at the container store. I really like it. That at night I can set things on here. It's got a little door little things you can slip in here and this is like for your letters but I put my um, phone uh, uh, fiber cloth there let's wash this well this is working out good now in here I have another drawer ready to go it's down here I'm thinking let me see. Oh, I didn't wash this one out. Ooh. Ew. <laughs> Ooh. Let me take this out. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Purple. Let me spray this down. I'm sure you want to watch this, right? Vinegar water. Yeah, this has got to be 
They're really washed out. This is where my cans were, and I took all my cans out. That's gross. See, I'm not always a neat freak. Sometimes, I mean, it's winter. I have a tendency, I can get lazy and, and not wash things out. I think what I'm gonna do is actually, I just got a new thing of alcohol. And I'm going to get this started. Saturated. You having fun? <laughs> I am. To get things out of my sight and not have to look at them all the time, it's, it's going to be a joy. There goes that boom box. See, what kills me about them boom boxes is they think we, they think that we think it's cool. <laughs> like, ooh, that's cool. He's cool, man. You're cool. You can go <laughs> I guess, I don't know if it takes a lot of talent to do that. <laughs> Does it? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so here, I'm thinking, okay, I got food here. This is, I want this to be easy to get into. That's why I wanted it right here in the middle. The middle one's the easiest one to get into. This is, huh. This is like things like my toothpaste and my face wash. Deodorant. Face creams, yeah. So that's what this one is. But I need another one to put this in now. I have these odds and ends, and I'm sure it's going to end up filling up big time. This one. So it really, I wish. Some of these bottles are too big to fit in the drawers, but I'm thinking that I've got some of these other things. Hmm. This is stuff I took out of my um, my tackle box. If you know, <laughs> let me show you my tackle box. I took them out of my tackle box to make it easier to carry what I really want to carry into the gym. So I think for now, I'm going to put this in there because I need to rearrange both of these. This is my tackle box. It's a tackle box, a fishing tackle box. And it's got my makeup that I can carry this into the gym. Makeup, makeup, stuff for my face, hair. And then in here, I've got um, my hair stuff. You know, my new Moroccan oil that I'm trying to get my hair to be more healthy. So, but I couldn't carry everything in here. So I thought, you know, I've got to open up another drawer to put stuff in. And so that's what I did. Now I'm gonna redo this on my own out of the camera because I gotta get everything out of here too. And it's starting to get long. <laughs> oh my gosh. So let me see. Here, I think I can do this so you can see this. Let me get this down and this down. But I can go ahead now and put this here. And I can put Minnie there. And this is my Raven. I'm in love with Ravens and I found this Raven. He's so cool. I found him, um, he was at the, sold at the uh, Grand Canyon area. 
I got Paul one too. And there's, oh, get up there. There's my Raven. This is a gel pad and they stick on that. So now this is free. And I can put this on here too. Um, the gel pad for some reason doesn't work on this shiny material, but it seems to like stay, so it doesn't really go anywhere. And I can do put this here, and then I don't know what I'm gonna do with that won't fit in there. Well, I'll just have to find a place for this, but this opens it up so it doesn't look so messy. That's my goal. I just don't want so much stuff hanging around that I have to look at day after day after day. Like I said, I can certainly open up a drawer. Let's, let's try it. Okay, let's pretend. I need a pen. Oh, it's not there anymore. Here's my pen. <laughs> let's see. I need my, oh, let's just pretend. Oh, I got to change color on my fairy light. Where did it, oh, it's in here. Oh, there it is. There's, let's change a color. Wait a minute. Let's change it to red. That's easy, isn't it? Okay. <laughs> it worked. Okay, so it's just a matter of shifting things around. You know what's going to happen. I guarantee it. I'm going to be shifting more things around. This is just the beginning. <laughs> this is just the start. It's spring cleaning time. I'm going to go to Quartzsite um, next week. And I'm going to take everything out of my bins. Out of, out of my van. My bins. Yeah, and out of my bins. And I'm going to wipe everything down. It's spring cleaning time. And out there I can take my time. Yeah. Might even put the tent up. Yeah. So cheers to spring cleaning and keeping things organized and, um, you know, looking good and, and having good mental health. So many partners for me. So love you guys. The book, minivanlee.com for neck gaiters, exercise tapes, glasses, the big glasses. And um, what else? Oh, and Shemogs. Shemogs and exercise videos till tomorrow i'm gonna keep going bye i love you thanks for spending time with me i do i let me just say this about that you know i know i've been talking to you, you leave me comments almost every video and i really feel that you are your energy is in every one of my videos and i'm not kidding it really is. I just feel that from you guys. And I think it works that way. That your energy is here. You are as much a part of this video as I am. Because I know, you know, the same, the, you are my friends. I know your names. And you watch this. And I know that you're going to comment on it every time. And the more you comment, the more your energy is into this. So... Please ask me questions, leave comments. Let's get your energy in it too. This isn't just my channel, this is all of our channel because this is our, our energy channel. This is our positive energy channel. What do you think? Do you agree with that? I do. Bye. Mm. <sighs> okay. I'm still here. Whoops. <laughs> Bye.